welcome back to Cruise First. It's lovely to have your company as always. Now, we're going to do something a little bit different in this show because this is one of our exciting tour shows. So we get to enjoy something far off the beaten trap and enjoy the trappings of a luxurious five-star cruise. Now, we're exploring South America this time, starting with Rio in Brazil and the chance to stand with Christ the Redeemer statue high above the city, enjoy the sheer power of the mighty Iguazu Falls from both the Brazilian and Argentinian sides and explore Buenos Aires before cruising to the bottom of the world with celebrity cruises on the Equinox on a Patagonia cruise, taking in Uruguay, the Falklands, Chile and Argentina. It's the trip of a lifetime and we've curated it perfectly so that you can just relax, take it all in and create some unforgettable memories. Your 22 night starts on the 29th of November for next year and we fly first off to Rio de Janeiro in Brazil. We'll meet you at the airport and take you to relax in your hotel before you start a fully escorted tour. This looks so exciting. Let's walk now through the highlights of the tour with Mark. Welcome to Brazil and the bustling capital Rio de Janeiro, home to white sand beaches and the world famous carnival. Here you'll spend an overnight soaking up everything this incredible city has to offer. Your first day will give you time to explore at your own pace. Be sure to check out the famed Leblon, Ipanema and Copacabana beaches or perhaps take a trip to the historic city of Petropolis to see the former summer palace of Emperor Pedro II. On day two, you'll take a full day tour of Rio. Here you'll have the opportunity to visit the most iconic attractions, starting with the Sugarloaf Mountain, some 396 meters above sea level. It offers panoramic views of the Lime, Copacabana and downtown districts. You'll then visit one of the new seven wonders of the world and Rio's most visited tourist hotspot, Christ the Redeemer at Mount Corcovado. Then you'll get to see the spectacular statue up close and personal, whilst also taking in the most impressive panoramic views of the city. On day three, you'll fly to Iwazu, where you'll spend two days discovering one of the seven wonders of nature, the breathtaking Iwazu Falls, where you'll be mesmerized. You'll first journey to the Brazilian side of the falls to see the mammoth series of 275 waterfalls cascading over the precipice almost two miles wide and 250 feet deep. Walk into Devil's Throat Canyon, where the clouds of mist, thundering roar and 180 degree rainbows surround you. And the exploration continues on day four with an escorted tour of the Argentinian waterfalls, including an excursion through the Iwazu National Park on board an open air ecological jungle train through the rainforest. You'll get the chance to enjoy an intimate encounter with the waterfalls and enchanting corners of the jungle before arriving at the Devil's Throat, the most imposing and beautiful fall. After a truly unforgettable experience in Iwazu, you'll then fly to Buenos Aires on day five. Here, you'll take a guided city tour to discover the full beauty of this vibrant historic city, including the stunning National Congress and May Square, plus the House of Government, the Metropolitan Cathedral, and one of opera's wonders of the world, the Colón Theater. You'll go on to visit the traditional neighborhood of San Telmo to experience its magical atmosphere that will feel like you're going back in time. You'll stop at La Boca, famous for its picturesque and colorful architecture, and then continue towards Palermo before finally visiting La Recoleta, one of the most exclusive neighborhoods in the city. That evening, you'll enjoy dinner and a fabulous tango show. It's a truly spectacular tour, taking in some magnificent sights from Rio to Iwazu and on to Buenos Aires. Looks absolutely incredible, doesn't it? And there you could be doing the tango I think they were doing there in Buenos Aires. It looked absolutely spectacular. And of course, that is part one of your exciting sort of combo holiday that we've got going on because we're going to continue exploring South America now by cruise. So we'll get on board next, the Celebrity Equinox, and we're on board for 14 nights. And we're all inclusive here as well, so a classic drinks package included and Wi-Fi. Uh, Wi-Fi is good actually because it's um, high speed accelerate Wi-Fi on board as well, which is very, very good, very reliable. Um, of course, this ship as well has the lawn club, as you can see. 
up there on top deck absolutely beautiful um, somewhere to really really just relax enjoy have a glass of wine just marvel at the fact that here we are at sea looking out from a lawn lots of lovely pools plenty of space as you can see for everyone indoor solarium there with a pool which is always just the most beautiful temperature when you wander through these spaces you're like i need to stop and relax and when it comes to stopping and relaxing celebrity is perfect for it because when it comes to cuisine uh, of an evening you've got such a massive choice you see a lot of people still think that you know cruising is all about non-stop stodge 24 hours a day no this is i mean there are cakes and desserts and lots of stodge if you want it but also nouvelle cuisine healthy options light bites right the way through the day and the night you can see real distinction in flavors here as well with the speciality dining tuscan grill the steakhouse murano italian so if you want just an intimate little dinner for two fantastic maybe some nice speciality dining main dining is like being in a speciality dining restaurant anyway um, on board these ships they are just beautiful lots of chances to shop on board as well if you want to and lots of activities going on but actually equinox is just about the right kind of size of ship with number of passengers to enjoy the trappings on board but also take what is one of the most fascinating itineraries that i've seen in a long long time in this part of the world because actually this is very much about the destination the beauty of the ship the luxury of the ship is a mere bonus let me tell you and it is absolutely stunning so let's take on board then 14 nights all together we've joined in rio de janeiro and our first port is down in montevideo in uruguay so it's the capital of uruguay here lovely colonial charm laid-back atmosphere the old town has cobbled streets that can take you back in time it has wonderful markets arts and culture there as well a couple of days at sea and we're in the falkland islands into port stanley uh, small and remote former whaling port great for wildlife as you can see up there at volunteer point with the penguins there good chance to stretch your legs and have a good old wander a day at sea and we'll cruise cape horn uh, around chile which is just beautiful again we're heading as you can see here pretty much to the bottom of the world head to hornos island um, just again enjoy the wonderful hiking here and many different activities as well next to ushuaia in argentina and this is the bottom of the world a mix of glaciers forests and sea all framed by mount marshall to the west and mount olivia and chinco hermanas to the east beautiful part of the world we'll scenic cruise through the strait of magellan through to punta arenas in chile uh, where you can trek through the magellanes national reserve or visit the penguin colony at sino otway lots of other attractions there as well day at sea and we're into puerto madryn this is a remote part of Argentina, actually. It's a wildlife sanctuary. Vast numbers of sea elephants, whales and penguins far outnumber the very few human visitors. So this will be a fascinating day. Day at sea, and then we're in Punta del Este in Uruguay. Uh, this is like the Can Riviera of Uruguay, actually. Chic shops and galleries on the Calagorlero, or spend a relaxing afternoon just people watching from a nice beach, beachside cafe. And then we arrive back into or into Buenos Aires in Argentina, and that's where we'll fly it back to the UK. But you can also talk to the team about spending some time in Buenos Aires if you want to. If you want a couple of nights in a hotel, we can add that to you. Of course, it's been part of your escorted tour before you cruise as well. So, lovely itinerary, gorgeous part of the world. I mean, a part of the world that a lot of people want to discover. And actually, I find myself speaking to a lot of people that have come back from an adventure in this part of the world and had a lot to say about it and said, you know, just how fantastic and diverse versus the picture they had in their mind and the, the actuality, two entirely different things. But culturally beautiful, unspoiled, really, really nice, interesting places as well. And of course, when you're doing it side by side, an escorted tour will tell you the story and fill in the gaps of what you're seeing. And the crews will do the same in a different kind of way, actually. It will suggest things to go and do on maybe escorted um, shore excursions. 
but also give you the pointers to, you know, just wander into town, wander into the city and go and see this or go and see that. It's amazing. So you've got that lovely flexibility and freedom on a holiday like this. Now, we can book the holiday today with a low deposit of just £249 each today. And I'll just talk to you about what that includes, because that's the flight out from the UK to Rio de Janeiro, which is, of course, in Brazil. Your six night escorted tour there followed by the two-week cruise on Celebrity Equinox to Patagonia and South America. Classic drinks included and Wi-Fi included while you're on the cruise. When we end the cruise, of course, we include the flight back to the UK from Buenos Aires. Um, when something is arranged like this where, and it is tailored, it comes with hefty price tags. But this one, given what we are doing and the intensity of what we are doing as well, because fully escorted tours, you know, day and night and the whole day stitched together in a group is not easy to do. It's very, very expensive. And yet we've combined that with a two week five star cruise, which is all inclusive and the flights and we've sorted it all out there for you for just a shade under £5,000 per person. So, very special experience. Yes, it's a considered sum, but not for what you are doing. And again, this is not the kind of thing that you will do. And I say this quite often. This is the kind of thing that's maybe once a decade, maybe once every two decades, once every very special occasion. Maybe you're saying, OK, that's it to the world of work now. I'm done. This is my reward for those 40 years of working. Or maybe this is our collective reward for 40 years of marriage, 50 years of marriage, 10 years of marriage, if you can do it. A deposit today of just £249 each will make it possible. Now, if you'd like to upgrade your cruise experience up to maybe an ocean view or a balcony or indeed a suite, we'll have a look at the prices for those. Whichever you choose, the deposit remains the same at just £249 per person. And I have to say, when we're looking at a, let's round it up and call it a £5,000 price tag, when we're in this kind of price zone, an extra 199 for your ocean view, even your extra 499 up to your balcony is kind of a fairly simple and easy decision to make. But I'll leave that with you. Take the best deal at 4999, including that escorted tour, the flights, and that two week uh, five star cruise, or treat yourselves to an upgrade. There is another date available for the whole package as well in 2026, if you'd rather look further ahead. 21st of February in 2026, and if you'd like to talk to the team about the price for that, then again, call the magic number on the screen. It's 0800 953 4700. This is one of those exceptional experiences. And, and listen, you know, you, you can take, maybe you're fortunate enough to take two or three cruises a year. I'm guessing you would have done fairly similar cruises over and over again. You know, different years, maybe different cruise lines, but you'll have done the Med round and round, or you've done the Caribbean round and round, and you're looking left and right for something a little bit different. One of these tailored experiences where we bolt together a land escorted tour, and then a really interesting cruise itinerary. It doesn't come around too often, actually. So take advantage of that combination because it is well worth it. And rather than paying the, the extras that you're paying simply for someone to arrange all of that, remember our tours team put all of these experiences together without adding an additional booking fee to that as well. So we're always looking for the best value around the world for you as well. There are many more of these tour shows as well. You'll find more on our YouTube channel, of course. Just search for Cruise First TV and you will find us there. And stay right where you are because as you know, there's always so much more on the way. But thanks for your company for this show. Stay where you are. Another idea around the corner.